Hello everyone. Happy Friday. I hope you all are doing well. I just wanted to hop on here uh, quickly just to give you guys an update on R. Kelly's New York uh, sentencing. Yesterday, Jennifer submitted a three-page letter to uh, Judge Donnelly requesting leave to file a supplemental uh, sentencing submission upon her receipt of the mitigation experts' uh, reports that she's expected to receive on June 9th. Uh, the government doesn't object uh, if she can't obtain it by, I guess the original date was May 26th. Um, and uh, what she put in bold, uh, he cannot, you know. So uh, Jennifer is also asking for an extension until June 13 to file uh, R. Kelly's sentencing submission and requesting that the sentencing hearing be pushed back a week or even a few days. And of course, uh, the government wants to keep the original sentencing date, uh, which is June 15th. So uh, the judge entered an order today granting Jennifer uh, that extension uh, to adjourn uh, the sentencing. And let me read that for you. I do have a copy of that order as well. Um, it was entered today, like I said, Order granting 297, the defendant's motion to submit a supplement to his sentencing uh, submission. The existing deadlines for the party sentencing uh, submissions will not be extended, except the defense is permitted to file its supplement by June 13. The sentencing hearing currently set for June 15 is adjourned to June 29th at 10.30. No further adjournments will be granted. And that's ordered by the infamous Judge Ann M. Donnelly. So uh, the original uh, sentencing date that they uh, moved from June 16th to June 15th is now uh, set for June 29th at 10.30. So I just wanted to hop on here to update you guys on that. Uh, Jennifer is getting what she wants slowly but surely. So, um, man, I'm still praying that he's acquitted. But um, just reading that letter, she definitely knows what she do she's doing. And I really hate that people is questioning this woman. Uh this is not her first uh, rodeo. This is not her first year studying law or practicing law. So all of you wannabes, I know you guys mean well when it comes to Robert, but when you're dealing with a professional that actually has the degree in the field in which they're speaking, don't challenge that. Seriously, I don't care how much research you've done. If you don't have the degree, you don't really know, okay? Get certified and then voice your opinion. But what I saw, what you guys, um, what I saw someone put on Twitter, that was ridiculous. You don't know this woman by now? This woman knows exactly what she's doing, working on emotions. Now, you got an attorney working on emotions. You don't want that attorney on your case, okay? This case is all about the law because no one followed it but Jennifer Bonjean. So I just wanted to update you guys on that, okay? And um, as I get information, you know I'm going to share it. So have an awesome rest of your day, and I'll talk to you guys soon. Take care. Bye-bye.